I am uh, representing the Portland local chapter of the Open Source GIS Users Group. And, uh, woo! But you know, actually, this is a little busy, this slide, so I thought I'd maybe uh, change it up a little bit and see, uh, oh, are we playing? Make it a little more Apple-y since I'm on a map, or on a Mac. <laughs> so for all of those of you suffering through uh, Apple latest update. Um, so our group does work as uh, where we are a local chapter of OSGO, and we're also a special interest group to the Oregon Southwest Washington uh, URSA organization. And the goal of OSGO is to provide education and outreach uh, in support of open source geospatial software. Um, these are some of the things that OSGO does. Um, I've highlighted some of my favorites, which I'll talk about briefly, um, like the little web mapping stuff, like GeoServer, MapServer, and OpenLayers. A set of tools for doing all of those little slippy maps that everyone loves so much. Um, Quantum GIS is a graphical GIS with an emphasis on simplicity and cross-platform interoperability. It also works on Mac, Windows, and Linux. It has all of the data formats and everything that you want. It's pairs GVSIG comes out of Spain originally, and it, built with the Sextante library, actually has a really huge spatial analysis tool set that you would have to pay thousands of dollars for if you were going from certain proprietary vendors. Um, <laughs> they also do a bunch of libraries for other, building other software, my personal favorite being PostGIS, uh, which is an engine for storing, querying, and manipulating vector and raster data within Postgres and Proj4, which is a library for doing projections. Um, we have Geos, which is uh, vector manipulation and analysis, and Goodle is how that's pronounced, which is a set of utilities and libraries for managing raster data. And these are all actually very, very widely used, and in fact, you'll see them showing up in some surprising places. Like here we have Goodle in a certain uh, GIS product that we all know and sometimes don't hate too much. Um, and so anyway, you can try all this out if you go and download the OSGO Live C DVD, which is a bootable DVD that has all, these, all the software that OSGO puts out and a bunch that is not supported through OSGO and has a quick start guide and all sorts of fun stuff to get you through all of the different pieces of software. And if that's not enough for you, you can go to the free and open source software for Geospatial Conference. Uh, the next one is in Nottingham next year. And if your budget does not allow you to travel the world uh, between now and the next time it's in the US, there are uh, regional ones too. So a little about PDX OSGO. Um, we drink beer and eat pizza on a monthly basis. And if anyone wants to sponsor us for drinking beer and eating pizza, uh, come talk to me afterwards. Um, URSA does help do that for us, I might add. Um, just the pizza. We're not allowed to buy beer with that money. Uh, <laughs> oh, excellent. Well, there goes that budget. So, uh, <laughs> um, and we do regular outreach events, usually via conferences like this one. You can look for us uh, uh, at this booth. And we've also done unconferences in co coordination with JX, GIS and Action Conference, which is put on by Oregon Northwest Washington, URSA, or Southwest Washington. Um, are, you, are you familiar with the unconference? No. So an unconference is a conference, but it has no fixed agenda. And what happens is everybody gets together at the beginning of the conference and we decide what we're going to talk about. Which sounds really chaotic, but it's actually great because the quality tends to be really high. This is actually a, a meeting board from, the, from uh, WhereCamp, which came up when you, know, you get together and everybody puts together these ideas. We do it for over two days and it's actually a lot of, lot of fun. And you don't do PowerPoint? Nope, and you get great ideas like this. <laughs> Which is, why, which is one I'm going to, uh, I stole that from WearCamp Europe. Um, I think we'll have to do that at the next WearCamp PDX, which is just in a couple weeks. And so if you're in the region, then you should absolutely come by. There's a great month in Portland for conferences. Um, it's also time to coincide with the State of the Map Conference, which is the US conference dealing with OpenStreetMap. Um, WearCamp is free, State of the Map costs 75 bucks. I know it's rough. <laughs> um, but I strongly suggest you all come, because these are all, it's gonna be a great weekend. Um, 
before Nasus. And finally, because I had room for one more slide, here's a picture of our two bunnies and our cat. <laughs> so get out, start your own local OSGO chapter, and uh, that's it. Thank you.